Look, my hat can say hi. Isn't that cool? My, uh, my mom and dad's friend Kevin got me this hat from Thailand. Yeah. That's not, that's really nice of him, huh? Yeah. <gasps> you guys. Hang on. Get your baby. Everybody's mad at J-Lo. Yeah. I mean, do you know, you don't know how hard it is to lip sync? And, and do a bad dance routine? That's hard. Look at the people on TikTok. Nobody gets mad at them. And their lips don't even match the song. Yeah. Oh, but they say you can't look J-Lo in the eye. No. But you know what? I figured it out why. Yeah. J-Lo is Medusa. I know that because I'm smart. Yeah. She, they'll just turn to stone. You can't look at her. Oh, I gotta keep it short. Oh, guess what? I don't have school all week. Nope. Nope. Cause it eats your week. Yep. Okay. I, it's time for my mom. Alright. I love you guys. Like and subscribe, okay? I love you. Bye. Hey everybody, I hope you're having an amazing day. My name is Vicki King and welcome to King Gone Crazy. Today, the attack of the Mega Karen. Here we go. Crazy Karen uses my private Tesla charger. No way. Hi, excuse me, ma'am? Can I help you? I see that, but this is my house and it's my charger that you're using. I know, it'll be like 20 minutes. Yeah, but that's really not, you can't just pull up to some, in someone's driveway and use their charger. You didn't even ask for permission. I mean, maybe if you knocked on my door and asked me, I would have potentially let you, but you just pulled in my driveway. My wife's about to be home any minute now. You're in her spot. Unplug her and send her on her way. Okay, well, I'm pregnant. My car's about to die. So I had no choice and I saw that there was an empty charger. Are you recording me right now? Is that why your phone's up like that? I am recording you because you're on my property and I'm sorry that your car is about to die, but you know, there are superchargers that you're supposed to, Tesla will tell you when your car's about to die. I mean. Okay, so you have to stop recording me and stop recording my plates. My husband is an attorney, so you're not going to put this video anywhere, so I'm not sure what you're doing. What? This is insane. Playing with your phone. How, I mean, do you normally do this? Do you normally pull up to people's houses and use their chargers? Normally my car isn't dying. I had to go to the doctor. My car was dying on the way home. I'll be done in like 20 minutes. It's really not that big of a deal. I mean, <laughs> you didn't even ask for permission. I, I, I what? Is it that big of a deal? Are you using it right now? I wasn't using it, but you're in my wife's car. That's not the point. It's his electricity. In a spot. Okay. And can I help you? I mean, uh, <laughs> where are you? It'll be done in 15 minutes. You know, I don't understand the big deal. I understand. Would you like a pregnant woman to be stuck in the road? Uh, no, well, I mean, it's not my problem that you're pregnant. Just because you're pregnant doesn't give you permission to do whatever you want. No, but if there was a charger and my car was about to die, then yes, I was going to charge my car. Are you insane? Can you back yeah, away from my car, you're please? In my can you get off of his property? Driveway. I understand that, but can you back away from my car, please? All right, I, I need you to unplug and drive away. Otherwise, I need you to stop recording. I need you to unplug and drive away, otherwise I'm going to call the police. Okay, well, I'm okay. going to call my husband, and he's going to... All right, that's fine. You can call... You can call... Is this a skit? Or is this real? Whatever you want. Please, can you please just unplug and, and drive away, please? I need, like, ten minutes. Just unplug and drive away, I would please. unplug her. Otherwise, I'm going to have the police here. 
See, it's not. It, it worked just fine. I didn't even know. Put it back yourself. I'm not putting it back either. Alright. Have a nice day, man. Please do not come back here again. No problem. The audacity. He he has so much more restraint than I would. I would have just unplugged it. I This Karen had some serious road rage when she cut off this other driver. She then ran up to the vehicle only to kick and punch it, damaging the vehicle, and then fled the scene, meaning there was no insurance information exchanged. This victim then ran over to this Karen to try and get some information from her, only for this Karen to try to drive over her in an attempt to flee the scene. Let's have a look. to this point. Oh, people suck. They just suck. Entitled Karen gets arrested on train after meltdown. Nothing ever happens here. I think that's why I love Karen so much. And I'm Officer Angel, Spoke of Police. They, they're asking us to ask you to step off the train. So can we step off please and go talk out there? Uh, can I tell you what happened? Out there. They... No, listen, first of all, I bought Hold a on. ticket to wait. What's your name? Ago. What's your name? Angela. Angela? Please do it my way because the other way is you're going to get arrested. And we really, Why really, would I get arrested when because, I put a ticket that I'm done doing? So let's, show me let's, what I'm doing. Let's, let's, what let's I'm deal doing with wrong. them. Let's deal with them outside as far as your ticket and getting your money back, whatever you need. But we need to step off the train, please. So please. But do you understand that I'm not doing anything wrong? I, I understand. We'll talk more about it on the platform. But please let's step off the train so we don't have to. So I bought a ticket to Wixaibo to be on time. You're not listening. No, I'm listening Grab that you want me to get out of the train. Please, to so, you're, to so you don't get arrested for trespassing. Why am I trespassing when I walk at the end? Uh, why you said that? I'm why telling you, you I'm ma trespassing right ma here. Ma open your bag. Ma open my bag. I have a friend that acts like this when she's drunk. Uh, Ma'am, I'm telling you that they asked me. She knows who she is. To get you to leave the train. Now I'm asking you to leave the train and you're telling me no. Now I'm telling you, you need to grab your belongings and step off or you're going to be under arrest. No, I know. I understand that you're going to make me under arrest. I don't want to. I don't want to. You're not understanding that. No, I understand, but okay, I need please. you to tell me. I have my rights as a citizen. I is... haven't done anything okay. wrong. Okay, okay. Can I bought a ticket. Uh, no, please explain to me because I bought a ticket we two will, weeks I can ago. explain it on... She's a spicy Latina. Biggest Karens. I don't stop. I never stop. Yeah, you do. What? I you, do not. You think we bang on the ceiling for fun? You bang on my ceiling all the time. I am so you think tired we do it of it. For fun? You think we do it because we're bored? I am tired of you. Well, I'm tired of you, lady. I'm tired of having to listen to your crap every night. I don't do it every night. Every night. Oh, really? 
Oh, yeah. uh, really? You need to get her, sir. You, you can get, get my ass. I am tired of you. Oh, thank you. Oh, I am not going hey, anywhere. Let me tell you something. My kids are asleep. Get your ass back upstairs, lady. I am so tired of you. Get upstairs. Go home. Honey. Go home. Hey, you need to get her. I'm gonna call the cops. You need to get her. Come on, honey. Call him for what? Because, because you're I, because you're on my I'm doorstep screaming my at me. You're on my doorstep screaming at me. And my father is asleep. Why don't you come up to my house? I do. We you have, don't answer the door. Answer the door. Go what? go home. Why go should home. I answer the door? Go home. So lady. you can call the cops. Listen, my kids are in here asleep. Go home. I don't care about kids. I don't care about you. Do you know her? I know you don't care about me. It's my You know her? We're the she's, she's, she's my aunt. I just got here. I've been driving. I don't I don't actually know who's in the wrong. I mean, I mean, she's yelling louder than everybody else, but I don't know. I don't know if because I don't know just before they started filming what happened. So I don't have the full context. I don't know if he antagonized her to get her to that point. Or is she just crazy? I don't know. Makes for a good Karen video, though. Karen public freakout. I feel so attacked right now. I don't know what to do. Somebody oh. please send help. I'm just so attacked. Help. He's a gamble. He's a gamble. I get this ham sandwich out of my court. <laughs> Somebody get this ham sandwich out of me. Oh my god. That's funny. Here's your boo boo doo doo. Here's your boo. Here's your boo boo doo. What are you doing? Karen in the wild. No rules. Don't talk to me. That says Merry Christmas. Don't say Merry Christmas to me. We have three of us. Merry Christmas, man. Thanks. God bless you. Wow. You know, around Christmas, I always say happy, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays sometimes, you know, if I'm not sure, you know, how people feel. But um, why do you take that so seriously? Why, why do people take that so seriously when you say Merry Christmas? You know, it, it, does it really matter? Really? What a miserable person. Okay, that's all I have to say about that one. Karen yelling at an employee at Starbucks. can control their emotion. That is absolutely unacceptable. Jesus. I witnessed a Starbucks Karen firsthand today. Nothing says I've never been told no in my life more than the, more than these temper tantrum kids. We're going to start saying no everywhere. Hey, 
Wait a minute. You don't make assumptions like that about people. Maybe they're just going through a really hard time right now. At least they... You know, if I can help someone, I will. I've been, I've been asked in the grocery store to buy a small item, and, and we've done it. Because I think it's good juju, you know? Good karma going back and forth. And if you can't afford it, just say, I can't afford to do that right now. I have my own family, you know, and people move on. This was uncalled for. <clears throat> they didn't deserve this. Let's finish the video. And this is Walmart security! Security! <laughs> you tell us I want to stop. I want to erase their pictures. Sir. Hey, hey. No, they don't have to do anything, man. Okay. So I can go ahead on Facebook and let you all know. Sure. They're doing it again. Sure. Take Listen, let's stop, bro. Come on, y'all gotta go. Oh, we gotta go. Hey, man, don't touch me again. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> you stop them. Stop them. Stop them. Hey, don't you put your hands on them. What's wrong with her, yeah? Take them out of the store. <laughs> Damn, Damn. Calm your ass down. I think deep down she's just a racist. In all honesty, you can just see it in her. Absolutely disgusting woman. <laughs> I'm saying I'm threatening you, so I'm recording to protect myself. Person. That would be so cool. I know that sounds really stupid, but yeah. I have no excitement in my life whatsoever. None. <laughs> Racist Karen freaks out in Walmart. Well, you're just causing a scene in the store. I'm not. She is. But no, I, I think you did watch it. No, you already I, heard, I heard you from she the office. Is. That's because she was mouthing me. No, I said, excuse me. So don't tell me it's my fault. And you said, every time I'm on an aisle, people just come near me. I was talking to you. And I said, I'm sorry. I said, I'm sorry. If you don't like it, I, I need to get my medicine. No, I'm not. Wow. Just get your stuff and go. Oh. Or does she have to tell anybody to get their stuff and go? Wow. Shopping is well. Oh my gosh. She has every right to be here as you. And I'm not going to listen to her mouth. You don't have to listen to her. But she's still I here and has every right to shop. I do. Which is what you're doing as well, ma'am. Yeah. Well, I'm just trying to resolve a conflict here, that's all. Yes, I am. Exactly what I'm trying to do. The conflict is her. I didn't do anything and to you, ma'am. You push your like cart towards me and push me. I didn't push you. Yes, you, you pushed push me you. with your cart. Oh, whatever. <laughs> I ain't listening to this whole You know, you never know who you're going to run into when you go shopping. It's really sad. It's kind of sad. I wonder what goes on in, in their head, you know, when they're talking to people or screaming, screaming at people that they can't process what's happening and they just want to attack. I don't get it. I'm kind of a calm person. You know, it takes a lot to really make me mad. You have to do a lot to make me mad. Wow. <laughs> Good luck out there, guys. Karen got triggered by the mariachi. 
in the Mexican restaurant? Honestly, I love it when they do these things. I love the mariachi band. Cinco de Mayo is a big day for it. is it to have a mariachi band in a Mexican restaurant? I mean, you know, these people are just so miserable that they're just on the attack all the time and they're just looking for people to go after. Start enjoying your life and stop worrying about everybody else. It's so dumb. That's all I have for this one, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today watching my videos. I love you. Come back and see me again, okay? And if you could, give me a like and subscribe. I'm still trying to get out there. I'm really working on it. Have a great day, guys. Till next time. Bye.